Hi Pisces, welcome to your reading. So the first card we have out is the Justice card. So you guys might be dealing with a Libra, or this can uh, symbol symbolize dealing with a your karma, a karmic situation. You know, karma can be good or bad, so you could be um, receiving back some good karma from the past where you have given to others and now you're reaping the rewards or the benefits. Um, it's followed by the Three of Pentacles. So if this is someone that you're dealing with, I see that they will be putting an effort and teamwork with you in the next uh, month or so. We also have the Queen of Wands, so you could be dealing with a fire sign, Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius, or you could be embodying these qualities yourself. You could be feeling very feisty or passionate, um, going after your desires. We have the Five of Wands here, so I do see some conflict, some fighting, um, and also, someone is spying on you from afar with that page of swords. So this could be online, they're checking out your social media, your Facebook, your Instagram. And I'm not sure if you're in a third party situation, but someone here is either juggling or trying to decide. Um, it's underneath the Three of Pentacles, so it could be trying to decide between you and someone else. But I see that you're gonna be you're gonna be getting your um, your wish here, the Nine of Cups. Um, it could be something that is very stable between you and someone else with so the Knight of Pentacles. It might be coming in slow here, but it's a stable foundation to build upon. Um, I see someone here with the Four of Pentacles is either, they're holding back from from expressing their true feelings to you, which is why they might be in this page of swords energy, like wanting to communicate, wanting to come forward, but not really doing anything about it, not really taking action, just going to spy on you, like just going to keep an eye on your social media. And I see that with the Ten of Wands here, uh, there's something that has been burdening you. It could be that this person is juggling you or has you in a third party situation. But that's coming to an end and you're going to hear from them soon. You have communication here with the Eight of Wands and the World card. So closing out a cycle, it could be a karmic cycle, since the first card we have is justice and then the world card is at the end. So could also be dealing with a fixed sign. So that would be Taurus, Leo, Aquarius, or Scorpio. Alright, let's clarify this reading for Pisces. So two of pentacles with justice. Someone needs to make a decision here. Uh, like how we were saying earlier, if this person is juggling you and someone else, then uh, someone needs to make a decision. So why is the Three of Pentacles here? Let's clarify the Three of Pentacles. 
for Pisces. Why is the Three of Pentacles here? Wow, we have the Ace of Wands. This, someone in this situation that you're dealing with is feeling very passionate about you. They want a new passionate um, spark with you. They think that you're very alluring, very sexy, charismatic, charming. Wow, we have the King and Queen of Wands. So there's a true pair here, both um, fire, so you might be dealing with a soulmate, but a lot of passion between you two, a lot of chemistry. Okay, so Seven of Swords, um, unfortunately that can be deception, so there could be something that is hidden between you, someone's hiding or lying about something that is causing conflict or is causing, um, a fight, but I see a lot of passion here. Alright, why is the Page of Swords here? Why is this person just spying on Pisces and not coming forward? So they are definitely being very stubborn and holding back from expressing their true feelings, but they're not coming forward and telling you, they're, they're holding on to you too. It's a way to hold on to you, is to not come forward um, towards you, but in my opinion, I just think that they're going to lose you anyway with that attitude, but, but maybe that's their way of, their only way of holding on to you. Why is the Two of Pentacles here? Why is the Two of Pentacles here? So, Ace of Pentacles. Yeah, so you're wanting a new stable start with someone or a commitment from someone here. Um, or they might be possibly wanting this with you. But someone is still juggling here. I'm not sure what that's about. Why is the um, Nine of Cups here? Why is the Nine of Cups here? Because you're someone's wish fulfillment. Someone is manifesting. But let's see. What is the clarifying card? Seven of Cups. Yeah, so someone has finally chosen you. They've decided that you are it above all other options. Why is the Knight of Pentacles here? Why is the Knight of Pentacles here? Three of Wands. Okay, so you or this person has been waiting for this for a long time. You've been waiting for things between you two to calm down, to be more stable, to be more reliable. Uh, you might need to take some time out from this person. A break is on the horizon for you two uh, to main maintain your stability. But um, the universe is asking you to trust in divine timing. And any time you may feel like you're questioning this, um, just go within and you can find the answers within yourself. So this person wants to reach out to you, but they're afraid that you would rather be single than to deal with them. They see you starting a new chapter in your life and it makes them want to be a part of it. Why is the Two of Wands here for the overall energy? Why is the Two of Wands here for the overall energy? So, the Fool card. Yeah, so someone wanting to a new start with you. Alright, let's pull some Angel Oracle cards. Can I get three for Pisces? Three Angel Oracle cards. For the sign of Pisces. For this love reading. So the first one is uh, romantic feelings. Your feelings are real and worth exploring. 
And Pisces, I feel like you guys can be a very romantic sign. And that's very attractive, like, to this person, I'm feeling. Getting to know each other. As you reveal your innermost selves to each other, your bond deepens. And then give your relationship a chance. Work on your partnership. All right, well, that's your reading. Thank you so much for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe. We'll see you next time.